What's up guys, we are back. We're going to be opening up four packages today. Um, three bubble mailers and one box. So we'll go ahead and open up the box for now. Just because it's the biggest one that's on here. So, And again, I'm just buying stuff that I think will... Um, that I find either... Uh, an opportunity with to flip or stuff that I am planning to hold uh, long term so all right and we got another box this side now. So yeah guys, let me know how you guys are doing out there, uh, what you guys are buying and investing in. Curious to know what you guys are, uh, oh, sorry about that, almost knocked you guys over. Another box. All right. This time it's a bubble miller from FedEx. Extremely urgent. Yes, it is. And here we go. That is a full box, very nice, sealed. Of oh, Skybox Emotion Cards. Uh, for those of you who don't remember or that uh, haven't seen the video, but I opened up, uh, I think it was 10 packs of these I bought um, loosely from um, uh, e eBay seller. And of course, you know, I'm always skeptical when, when I buy stuff like this off eBay. Uh, but I opened all 10 packs and I ended up hitting uh, the biggest card in the set, which is the Michael Jordan, or I, th I think it's the second biggest. I think there's another one. I think, no, actually it is the biggest one, the Intense Michael Jordan card. Um, I sent that off to grading to SGC. Uh, I got a SGC 10 on it, and then I recently sold it for $770, I think it was. So, but yeah, you could uh, go check that out on, on eBay. You know, definitely check out... Um, you know, in case you don't know how to look at eBay sold listings, uh, you know, of course, uh, eBay itself has a sold options menu button there. They, you could type in the card name and then uh, look at sold. And then if you're looking up cards that are a little bit older, you know, that were sold a while back, uh, you know, a few weeks ago or months ago, I like to use 130 point uh is the one that i like to use so but any of those you can look up 1994 uh emotion skybox emotion intense michael jordan sgc 10 for about 740 770 something like that that was my card norman powell very nice. This is a 2017 Prism. So this is not his rookie card, but still a very nice auto. That would be very uh, interesting to see what happens with him. Because I think um, he's with the currently with the Trailblazers and... 
you know, Trailblazers right now, you just don't know what's going to happen with Damian Lillard and CJ McCollum. There's been a lot of rumors and speculation that one or both are going to be traded this offseason. So if that happens, then Norman Powell may be their, their scorer going into next season. So we, we shall see what happens there. But here we go. So this is from one of my buddies that I usually uh, break with. Well, not break, but I get into his uh, his lines, and I was able to score uh, Chronicles. Uh, what was this? Hanger Box? I think. So I got myself a 2020 Prism, Joe Burrow, Clyde Henry Ruggs, Denzel Mims, Chase Claypool, Cole Kmet, Brandon Ayuk, the Michael Pirine, the Visca Chenault. Brandon Ayuk, Chase Young, Jonathan Taylor, T. Higgins, Jake Fromm, another Joe Burrow, another Joe Burrow, Atua, Jonathan Taylor Green, Gabriel Davis, Clear Vision, and Jordan Love Classics. So very nice. I scored that. I think I paid... Um, I think it was a line for Chronicles Hanger Pack. He usually does them for 10 lines times $3. And I was able to hit on $3, I think. So not too bad investment there. But again, it's all by luck. So. So I bought this off one of the guys I usually buy uh, some high-end cards from. So this is a da Damian Lillard. I think this is his rookie card. Autograph. And I was very skeptical when buying this one. It cost me $260 because it's a, it's a sticker auto. And it is just, this thing is just god awful ugly. I mean, even the PSA case, the... The label just looks just got awful ugly, but to my to the best of my knowledge, this is a legit card auto. There's plenty of these. There's well, not plenty. There's a few of these that are up for sale on eBay, exactly like this, and the comps are quite a bit more than 260. So, but yeah, interesting to say the least. But. That does it guys for today, today's mail day. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, definitely have some interesting stuff that spans quite a bit of price ranges. So, But that's about it guys. Thank you very much for watching and talk to you later.